What's going on guys? My name is KillerB61. Welcome back to Destiny Tracker. We just came back from watching the awesome Destiny 2 reveal trailer. This is not a teaser, this is an actual trailer this time. So we're going to go ahead and show you that, then we're going to break it down piece by piece and take a look at all the cool new exciting things that we have been shown. But we are Earth's greatest hope. Look around you. A gathering of noble guardians new and old. Okay, listen up. Um... You're a bunch of dirty misfits, but you're all that's left, so you'll have to do. Our home was attacked. I was there, fought against the endless onslaught. They kept coming, so I kept firing. Not gonna lie, I was magnificent. Despite the sacrifice of many brave guardians, we lost everything. The tower, the city, our home. So, everything is gone. Your stuff, my stuff. Most importantly, my stuff. Today we know our enemy. His name is Gary! Or Gil. Glenn? Is it? I don't know. It's something with a G! Go! I know you look to me in times of peril, but this is not my battle alone. Which means if I don't see you out there, I'll kill you myself. It is time to avenge this injustice, for that is the duty of all guardians. Worst case scenario, you die. But who knows? Maybe you won't. So I ask you, who will stand with me? Yeah! Oh, really, guys? That, that was inspiring. Also, there will be a ton of loot! Yeah! Ah, yeah, right? That's what I thought. Pre-order and get beta early access. So that was a great trailer. We've got a lot of things to dive right into and speculate on. First thing I want to point out here is look at this freaking awesome shield. These Cabal are intense. I wonder if this shield is something that we can, you know, if you put enough bullets into it, it will disappear and then you can shoot it because that is that makes the phalanx is a lot easier to deal with in my opinion. This looks freaking cool. I really love this does this design here, the aesthetic that the Cabal have. Make them look less like monkeys and more like actual scary warriors. This right here was very interesting to me. Some kind of dog enemy that the Cabal have employed here. I mean, look at the armor on its face. Obviously, this is this is a battle unit, not, not like some kind of wild animal. We haven't really had anything like this in Destiny. And to see this coming to Destiny 2 is a really exciting thought. In this shot here, we get a little bit of a better look at it. It almost looks like a SIVA dog or something. It's obvious, I mean, the Cabal are attacking the tower, but it looks like it's SIVA-fied. That would be very interesting if uh, the Cabal actually got a hold of SIVA, and now we've got this whole new thing to deal with. Now, I like how they're explaining how all of our stuff kind of disappeared. You hear Cade say that everything's gone. Our stuff is gone, but more importantly, his stuff is gone. I mean, I understand that your stuff is gone, Cade, but you don't know what I had to do to get Vex Mythoclast. You just don't understand. Right here, we see our vault kind of collapsing in on itself. Uh, clearly, everything's destroyed, and that explains why we're going to have to go get some new gear and new exotics. Here we get a look at this new Cabal enemy starship thing. Very interesting aesthetic. Like I said in the first teaser trailer breakdown, we have not seen this faction of Cabal. And I, th I think I'm correct. This is a completely new faction that we have not seen yet. I mean, look at that ship. That looks completely unlike anything that we've seen before. If you follow the lore of Destiny 1, you'll know that the Cabal that we face here is a much, much smaller faction of Cabal than there really are. So this could possibly be the head honcho Cabal sending reinforcements to help the Cabal that we've just been totally destroying lately. Here we get a clear look at Greg. I think his name was Gaul, but Cade 6 called him Greg. That's what I'm going to call him. He looks menacing AF. Okay, look at this. He's got the whole spikes coming out the top. He doesn't even look like a Cabal besides the, si besides the size of his armor. Everything else looks completely different. Completely new aesthetic, and I'm loving it. Obviously, we see Lord Zavala uh, 
is rallying the troops very, very well, getting everyone nice and inspired. And then we come over to Cade Six, and he's the only, and he's the only one saying, "Yeah." There's a couple things to point out as far as the new look of the Guardians. Check out this hunter here. I don't think we've seen this armor before, especially not the gun in his hand. It looks almost like something straight out of Titanfall, mixed with a little bit of Amalan. We've never seen that before. And then when the Guardians raise their hands up to cheer, yeah, we see a couple things here. We've got an, a weapon right here that it looks like a railgun. That looks freaking cool. And then this here, obviously some kind of AR type. It could even be a scout rifle or something. Or scout rifles and auto rifles could be gone. They're completely different classes. I don't even know, guys. I don't even know how to wrap my head around all of this. And then Cade 6 says that there's going to be a ton of loot. And then everybody gets excited. And we see this weapon again in the uh, upper right-hand corner. It looks like a railgun. Ah, I can't wait to get my hands on that. I love railguns. And at the end, we are left with these very, very inspiring words. New legends will rise. And we're shown a September 8th release date. Sticking with the fall releases, it's, that's almost three years to the day of when uh, Destiny 1 was released. So it's pretty cool that they're staying so punctual. And then, of course, if you pre-order like last time, you get access to the beta. Something I want to point out about this image, though, if we see the ship that's flying across, it looks completely different than... It looks completely different from any other ships that we've seen in Destiny 1 thus far. I really like that they're revamping the whole aesthetic of Destiny 2. Everything's going to be different. And so maybe later on in one of the DLCs or in an update, they'll hit us with some member berries. And they'll bring us back some uh, old weapon foundries from Destiny 1. And we can play, along with, play around with our old weapons again. Maybe Galahorn will be that gun that's in every single game. <laughs> you never know. Anyway, guys, that closes out the video. My name has been KillerB61. You can find me on Twitter at Amin underscore Lamkita or here on YouTube at k, &K Media. We have a lot of fun there. I've got a little bit of a Mass Effect video coming out. Blah, 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 blah. Leave a like on the video to let me know that you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you haven't already and hit the little bell icon so that you can become part of the notification crew and stay up to date on all Destiny media and updates. We have another video going up today as well as the Zer Inventory review on Friday and the podcast on Friday, 8 p.m. Eastern Time. From what I've heard, we have a very interesting guest. I can't t tell you too much, but it'll be exciting. So make sure that you are there for that. Have a great day, Guardians, and I will see you in the next one.